Okay, so I'm gonna try to do the most difficult song in Hamilton solo. Solo. So let's see how that goes. I've done it a few times already, so my voice might be a little bit raspy, but we'll see. After the war, went back to New York. After the war, went back to New York. I finished up my studies and I practiced law. I practiced law, but I were next door. Even though we started at the very same time, Alexander Hamilton began to climb. How to account for his rise to the top? Man, the man is non-stop. Gentlemen of the jury, I'm curious, bear with me. Are you aware that we're making history? This is the first murder trial of our brand new nation, the liberty behind the liberation. I intend to prove beyond a shadow of a doubt with my assistant co-counsel Hamilton sit down. Our client Levy Weeks is innocent. Call your first witness. Okay, one more thing. Why do you assume you're the smartest in the room? Why do you assume you're the smartest in the room? Why do you assume you're the smartest in the room? Tonight, to be your tomb. Why do you write like you're running out of time? Write day and night like you're running out of time. Every day you fight like you're running out of time. Keep on fighting in the meantime. Corruption's such an old song that we can sing along in harmony, and no one is stronger than an harmony. The economy is economy, is increasing the all in us, see this what public service seems to be calling me. I practiced the law, I practically perfected it. I've seen the justice in the world and I've corrected it. Now for a strong social democracy, if not, then I'll be Socrates, throwing verbal rocks at these mediocrities. Hamilton at the Constitutional Convention. I was chosen for the Constitutional Convention. There is a New York Junior delegate. Now what I'm gonna say may sound indelicate. He goes and proposes his own form of government. His own plan for a new form of government. He talks to success I was the convention is listless. Yo, who the F is this? Why do you always say what you believe? Why do you always say what you believe? Every proclamation guaranteed. Free ammunition for your enemies. Why do you write like it's going out of style? Why do you say it like it's going out of style? Every day you cry like it's going out of style. Do what you do. Alexander? sir. Can we confirm, sir? Is this illegal or Yes, and it's important to me. What do you mean? you're a better lawyer than me. Okay, I know I talk too much. I'm abrasive. You're incredible in court. You're succinct, persuasive. My client needs a strong defense. You're the solution. The new U.S. Constitution? Hear me out. A series of essays anonymously published defending the document to the public. I disagree. Burr, that's why we need it. Someone needs amendments. So as independence, we have to start somewhere. You're making a mistake. Wait, what are we waiting for? What do you stall for? We won the war, what was it all for? Do you support this constitution? Of course. Then defend it. And what if you're backing the wrong horse? Burr, we studied and we fought and we killed. For the notion of a nation we now get to build. For once in your life, take a stand with pride. I don't understand how you stand to the side. I'll keep all my plans close to my chest. I'll wait here and see which way the wind will blow. I am taking my time watching the afterbirth of a nation, watching the tension grow. I am sailing off to London. I am accompanied by someone who always pays. I have found a wealthy husband who will keep me in comfort for all my days. He is not a lot of fun, but there's no one who can match you for turn of phrase. My Alexander. Don't forget to ride and look at where we are, look at where we started. The fact that you're alive is a miracle, so stay alive, that would be enough. And if your wife could share a fraction of your time, if I could grant you peace of mind, that would be enough. Alexander joins forces with James Madison and John Jay to write a series of essays defending the new United States Constitution entitled The Federalist Papers. The plan was to write a total of 25 essays divided evenly among the three men. In the end, they wrote 85 essays in the span of six months. John Jay got sick after writing five. James Madison wrote 29. Hamilton wrote the other 51! 
told you right, like you're running out of time. Right, say now, like you're running out of time. Every day you fight, like you're running out of time. Are you running out of time? Are you running out of time? How do you write like you wanna wanna arrive? How do you write like you needed to survive? How do you write every second you're alive? Every second you're alive, every second you're alive. They're asking me to leave. I'm doing the best so I can to get the people that I need. I'm asking you to be my right hand, man. I know it's a lot to ask to leave behind the world you know. Treasury. Treasury. Let's go. Alexander. Alexander. Giving away my shot. I am not throwing away my shot. I am Alexander Hamilton. Hamilton, just you. I am not throwing away my shot. <laughs> Bye.